Hi, Joe Devon here from Positive Living Skills, bringing you another PLS Tuesday tip. And it's a beautiful morning up here in Queensland, and we're lucky enough here to be able to, with full safety precautions, uh, go back to the gym. Um, so we have a gym close by here where we live, and uh, it's been about six months since we went, and you know we've been walking and that sort of thing. But it's the first time we've gone back and used some of the weight machines and the uh, treadmill and those sorts of things. Very, very fortunate that we can do that because we know a lot of people um, are, are, are restricted more than that and can only go 5k from their home and see one person at a time. And you know, really, really thinking about those people and sending them our support and uh, and warmth and and hope and, and trust and those sorts of things. But when you come back to something like that, it can be tempting to go, uh, you know, to jump straight in and go to a level that you want to get to in terms of your fitness, or, and this really applies to anything in life, any goal you want to achieve. Whereas what's really, what works, and, and we feel really good now that we've gone to the gym, but also starting small. So that was just reminded me and I thought I'd share that just as a reminder for all of us and we instinctively know it but sometimes we jump in and we want to achieve something big and so we jump in and we go all in and that can either leave us hurt or disappointed uh, or feeling despondent that we're not going to get there whereas incremental uh, effort is and Tony Robbins says this progress equals happiness just you know starting small one step at a time uh, James Clear wrote a book Atomic Habits and he talks about you know 1% incremental improvement and if we're always moving towards that then eventually over time we can achieve amazing great things so I just wanted to share that if you're working on something start small do one step at a time and even if you end up going backwards it's just an opportunity to come back and have another go even if it's after um, six months. So um, that's my PLS Tuesday tip. Thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day.